Hello everyone. Action as a Limpopo Premier candidate and Jefferson Lizzi Repatla has resigned from the party to join former President Jacob Zuma's Umkondo Wesizwe party. Patla was amongst the party's premier candidates appointed recently ahead of the 2024 national and provincial elections as announced by President Sir Ramaphosa for May 29. He also served as Action SA's provincial secretary in the province. His resignation comes months after Silo Lidiha, who was also chairperson, resigned to focus on his writing career. In a statement, the party confirmed it had received Patla's resignation letter and that his membership was terminated. The statement said, Action SA has accepted the resignation and terminated the membership of its Limpopo provincial chairperson, Letiri Patla, following the learning of his joining MK. It said the party, however, accused the chairperson of being sponsored to join MK party and said, it was later found out that Patla had been negotiating his membership of MK for some time while extolling the features of Action SA in the campaign. It is believed from credible sources that Patla was offered considerable financial inducement to join MK. This is the kind of patronage politics that has no place in Action SA. Action SA said his move was an indictment upon himself, explaining that any person who left Action SA to join MK had been ideologically confused and contributed to the notion of ethical leadership if they align with the values of Soma, and said, unfortunately, Patronage politics has become too common in South Africa and candidate deadlines have become like transfer windows for those whose political alignment is for sale. Action SA welcomes the departure of such compromised leaders from its ranks before of an election before they sit in legislature where they abuse the role of a public servant for their own ends. Patla previously served as the provincial chairperson of the Congress of Traditional Leaders of South Africa. The party announced that Victor Motomela will now occupy office, having served as the head of the party's campaign in the province since 2022. According to Action SA, he served as a corporal in the South African Defense Force, also as a detective sergeant in the South African Police Service, before going into business. What's your take on this one, people? Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more news.